die it downloads. Yeah, it's fine, you can play it. Play it, it's kinda of cool. Wait a minute, I keep putting the wrong mode. Why do I keep putting the wrong mode? Yeah. Oh. Uh. Uh -huh. um. I didn't turn it down yet. And I also haven't done the Twitch. <laughs> Uh, what am I doing again? I need to get onto Twitch. Okay, there should be good to go. Alright, yes we are good, we are Gucci. On to the start of the top 100 best games list. Uh, mostly objective, I mean it, it's a subjective list, there's uh, there's not much I can do about that, no matter what I do, even if I went to uh, 5,000 different community polls and you know put it all together and most people came to a consensus. There'll still be people out there be like, where is this not here? Isn't it? Oh, nee, 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 nee. So it's, it's, it is a subjective list at the end of the day. But what I've done is that I've gone to a lot of research to find out what is considered to be some of the best games out there. And I've gone, I've gone through a few different sources, or well, more than a few, um, to really find out. And then I've sort of mixed and matched some titles that weren't necessarily on some lists. Um, but games that are widely considered to be very, very, very good, and added it to it. Um, I didn't want to populate this list with, like, too many of the same games. So, for instance, pretty much all the Dark Souls are on, uh, are on most people's top 100, or community top 100, or whatever. But that's not really helpful, considering a lot of them play the same. So, there are entries in that list, and they will be coming later. Uh, unfortunately for me. I've never really wanted to play a Souls game, but um, I suppose the point of this list is to sort of gain new experience into what people consider to be the best of gaming out there. Because I'm playing the worst currently at the moment, and just finishing Sonic 06. Um, definitely puts a new perspective on life. Uh, <laughs> so, I want to see what the best list. And yes, I'm starting with something um, that firstly I had just... Uh, just ready to go. Um, the next one, number 99, is something I haven't played. It's a franchise but ne I've never touched, so that should be very interesting. Um, and yeah, it's just... It, there's been a lot of research, and it's still in, in its draft form at the moment, but this one was always going to be a number at number 100, just because, um, you know, I had it on hand. And look, I could talk to the cows come home, but I think it might be better if I do that through playing uh, the game. Now, I'm not playing all three, I'm just playing number three. As you can see, I've uh, completed all three uh, 100%. It spires one of those genres where you can do that. And, oh god, do I need to like reset it from somewhere? Is there no save files? Okay, I might need to figure out... Um, what the heck are any I'm doing first. Uh, while I do that, um, I have a great, great fondness for Spyro, the Spyro series. Um, I mean, mainly the early platformers. Um, yeah, I'm gonna need to... I'm gonna need to somehow delete my data. Uh, save slots. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. How's that? Yeah, I have a great fondness for the PS1 Spyro titles. I've played 1 and 3 a lot. 2 didn't really have access to, but I always had an original copy of Year of the Dragon. I still think I've got it somewhere. 
lying around. Um, and I've just played it a lot of times. It's just one of those ones where it's like, you know what, I'm really feeling like a Spyro kind of mood. And then you just do it. It's it's really good. So we're starting with an evil plot unfolding. Uh, I'll let the cutscene play for itself. Stop her! We managed to capture the eggs, Your Highness. Every last one. Excellent! Maybe you will amount to something after all. Now go guard the tunnels. Stop anyone from coming through. Where are the eggs? The holes came out on the other side of the dragon world. We found some of the eggs, but they were too heavy to carry back. The other side of the world? The Forgotten Realms. Spyro, you'll have to go. Nobody else can fit down the holes. Yeah, come on, let's go! Find the eggs and bring them back, Spyro. You're our only chance. You got it! Yep. Hell yeah! Um, God, this game looks pretty. God, it looks so pretty. I forgot how well the Reignited Trilogy actually, like, spruces it up. Um, yeah! Uh, so I'm confidently gonna go for 100% on this one. Like, it's going to happen with every single Spyro game. Well, no, every single game on this a top 100 list. It depends, um, like, what the 100% is. Um, cause I spend, like, 500 streams doing one game. Like, I do eventually want to get to the bottom of this list. Uh, <laughs> but some games may take longer than others. Uh, especially those lengthy RPGs that are definitely on there. Um, but for those, I'm going to try and stick to the main story as much as possible. Like, do some extra things here and there. But I don't want to, uh, yeah, just go so deep where <laughs> I, I forget what I'm doing this for in the first place. Um, so yes, I've, I'm going to go for 100% because I know it actually won't take me too long. This is not a long game, by any means. It's not a long game. Like, I feel like I can get this done in three streams, probably. It's Bill! Is a bell a bell? Great question. So your voice is the perfect volume. I have to hold my phone up to my head to hear the get in the game in the dialogue. And Spyro is meant to be 100%. Um, I will change that volume. It's probably because of Engage. Uh, and how loud that game is. Let's turn that up. Sixteen. We'll see how that goes. Um, um, I mean, Bianca's gonna pop down in a second, so let me know how that sounds when she when she starts talking. She starts yapping. 
This game looks so pretty. And like, I definitely, when I got this, um, I 100 at all of them, like, as soon as it came out, but I have not touched it since. Um, I'm still, I'm reeling from Sonic 06, like, I, I'm still playing Inverted. No, I gotta get out of that habit. God, that sucked. Um, okay, uh, let's see what Zoe says. Hi, Spyro. To look left or right, use the right stick. To quickly center the camera behind you, tap the center camera button. You can also look all around by pressing the action button. Did that sound okay? Did that sound very peachy? I thought Bianca was going to come down and yap. Oh, there she is. So, you're the one in charge of rescuing the eggs, huh? <laughs> How sad. Look here, dragon. If you know what's good for you, you'll turn around and crawl back into that hole you came through. Those eggs belong to us now, and I've hidden them in places you'll never find in a thousand years. Besides, even if you could find any eggs, our expertly trained armies would hunt you down and take them back. Do I make myself clear? If I find you here again, I am going to be very angry, and you won't like me when I'm angry. Face. Just, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you. That face, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you gonna do about it, huh? What you gonna do about it? I, I mean, everyone memes the crap out of that line. I, I've, I've hidden them in places you would look. Bro, there was one, like, right there. What do you, what do you mean? What are you, t what are you talking about? Um, I'm going to do the hub world stuff first. Um, because it's easy. Uh... Well, this could be a hot take and something that's interesting. I think this franchise is better than Crash. Not like the whole thing, um, but like if you're talking specifically like PS1 comparison, I think that Spyro games are much more playable than Crash games. Um, I think Crash games have a higher skill ceiling, which if you're into that, then that's great. But I just think this is more enjoyable all around. That is a hot take or not. Um, it's just that when I hear, like, talk of the PS1 days, like, it's always more, um, it's always more Crash than Spyro. I don't know if that's, like, a normal thing or not. So I actually haven't played this one, and I'm more partial to Spyro than Crash. You had not played this game. This is, like, the best one. <laughs> Easily. Easily the best one. It's good. One also has some merits too, but one is aged um, the greatest. There's definitely uh, more value in two and three than there is in uh, one for sure. It's still an enjoyable time. That's nice, Spark. We'll be doing your sections later. I was thinking about like adding some sort of challenge to this because I already know this game so well. Um, and look, I'm happy to take ideas for like strings after this, but I also was like, that also just sort of defeats the purpose of why I'm doing this. I'm not doing this to torture myself. I'm doing this to have a good time, actually play a good game. I'm definitely torturing myself enough. But you know, like, maybe if I like die or something, I'll have to... Oh, Alright, hang on. Okay, yeah, no, that's... They're down, is down, and... That's... Okay, they are inverted. I was like, okay, I, I'm, I'm tripping. Um, I just don't want inverted controls. Is, is that too much to ask? Retro controls? Is that still? Uh, I don't. I don't. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Oh, that's why. Cause I didn't. I... Right, hang on. Let's see if that's different. Feel too different. Girl's always inverted. Am I just trimming? Like, down goes up and... Hang on. Down goes up. And up goes down. Yeah, okay. So the... 
down inverted, but the um, other controls are not. It's really crazy. I mostly borrowed Spyro games from Resi stores. The only one I owned in 100% multiple times was Attack of the Rhinox in GBA. Um, I didn't play. I haven't played that one. I, I will admit, like after the PS1 era, my Spyro expertise is definitely lacking. The one I've 100 multiple times uh, is Season of Flame, though. Um, great game, Season of Flame. Really, really, really dig Season of Flame. Um, I did like play some of the others, but they didn't grab me. So see, left, left goes and right goes right, but then up. So down goes yeah. So uh, that's that's gonna that's gonna take some getting used to. So left and right's the same, but up and down is not. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I um, do recommend Season Flame though. Very good game. And then Spyro got into his uh, oof, <laughs> his weird phase where he's like, I'm now an action. Action beat him up. Let's let's uh, let's freaking go! And you're like, what is this? It's, it's not what we, this is not what we got into Spyro for. And like, I can appreciate games trying something different, but you strayed so far from what made Spyro Spyro. Is it really even worth going that route anymore? Three games, man. I enjoyed the first or second one. Got some merit out of it, I guess. But you know, the general consensus was like, what the heck is this? Um. But they keep doing it, and I don't understand. Not the greatest, and you have to 100% to beat the game, or else the end boss just loops animations, and you can't beat him, and you have to just turn it off. Oh, that's crazy. Alright, is that the one with the uh, two-headed boss? I remember watching a video on that. <laughs> um, Alright, so Hunter's going to teach us how to jump, because we don't know how to do that. Show Spyro! I just found one of those portal thing in the jigs that leads to a different world, but you'll have to glide to get across to it. Press the jump button, then press jump again while you're in the air to glide. Just follow me. Yep. Think so? That's not the one. Plus, is not like a twin-headed rhino. He's like a giant twin-headed rhino. Again, at the very top of your jump. Uh, maybe that's not the one then. Maybe season of ice. I, I don't know. I saw something shiny in that cave over there. All right, something shiny. Oh, I almost forgot. I found this egg. Unless I'm forgetting a minor boss. No, that was like the end game boss, and you you couldn't um, fully finish the game without doing 100%. I remember that. Season of Ice, but uh, I don't know. Alright, Hunter is a hoarder of eggs, guys. Don't don't trust Hunter. He, he's a bum. This is a super fly power up, Spyro. Whenever you walk through any power up that looks like this one, it will allow you to fly for a while. Uh, yeah, this game's gonna come and go. I know pretty much the ins and outs of this game. There's not gonna be too much. I still remember it very vividly. I've played this game way too much for anything to really be a surprise. The things that will be a surprise to me is just how gorgeous the graphics are in this game. Holy shit. <laughs> like, this game looks beautiful. I've forgotten how much, um, yeah, they did in the Reignited trilogy. God, it's, it's, it's gorgeous. It's absolutely gorgeous. What I'm looking at right now? Cool. The only thing I do miss is Hunter's voice from the PS1. It's like a little bit more silky smooth. Alright, we've got all the gems. Now it's time to get the eggs. I think we shall actually move on to the first world. <laughs> we didn't do too well there, did we? Oh, oh, no, no, that's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted. <laughs> it's the, it's the, the inverted control, I swear. Mm -hmm. 
did a great job. They, they really did. I'm ex just to see, yeah, the, the reignited trilogy environments again. Not so good. Alright, um, we've done most of the egg. What am I forgetting? Um, not that one. I'm forgetting one of the eggs. Got the one underwater. How am I forgetting? What egg am I forgetting? I'm going crazy now. Your game camera is currently in pack if you like. No, that's that's fine. Okay, I won't. Oh, wasn't there like a boulder I need to crack? Yeah, like right here. There we go. For gore. God. Okay, all right. Thanks, Liam, for crying. Crying all over me. Um, I actually start with Sheila's level. That way I can just do Sheila's um, bit in Sunny Villa. Straight away. Spyro! My, my, how funny to see you here. Why, I haven't seen you since we defeated Ripto in Avalar. Ha, <laughs> ha. Well, my business went into a slump after you left, so I came here and struck up a nice deal with the local sorceress. Lovely woman she is. Seems to be very fond of dragons, too. I'm getting paid a fortune to keep Sheila the kangaroo locked up. Ha, <laughs> ha. This pesky animal must have been causing a lot of trouble for that poor sorceress. I suppose I could accidentally let the kangaroo escape. If you were to pay me, say, a small fee. Ah, Spyro, I love your sweet naivete. Your kind-hearted nature might be your downfall someday. But for the time being, it's making me rich. Oh my god, you're right. Classic rich people, for sure. God, money bags is such a prude. <laughs> I uh, hope you appreciate this favor I'm doing in letting you out. That's good of you, mate. No hard feelings, eh? Right. After all, I'm just doing my job. Yeah. <laughs> I reckon you'd be one of them dragons then. Yeah, named Spyro. Never thought I'd see one. You dragons used to rule this entire world, you know. Then all of a sudden you left. Poof. Dragons used to live here? Didn't you know? They say it was over a thousand years ago, I think. And they just left? Yeah. And the weird thing is, after they left, all the magic in the world just sort of went with them. I mean, they say this world used to have magic coming out of the wazoo. Flying ships, singing forests, wishing stones, you name it. But when the dragons left, it all just dried up. Is that why some of the portals don't work? Yeah, they're starting to fade out too, one by one. Well, I gotta get back home and do some damage control. Come visit anytime you like. Fire attack of the Rhinox is what I learned what a didgeridoo is. <laughs> yeah, classic Australian didgeridoo! Beat pie! Vegemite! Yep, Sheila, Sheila is definitely Australian. Because kangaroos are Australian. God forbid we get a French kangaroo. Oh! Meat pies. Oh. Thanks again, Spyro. Now I have to find out what that nasty sorceress has done to my home while I was locked up. Hi, Sheila. While you were gone, a bunch of rhinox kicked us out of our houses. It's okay, though. Bobby, Pete, and I are working on a clever plan to take them back. Yeah. Now I have to get used to another control scheme. Let's go. This level's always pretty simple. I don't think there's like a particularly hard shield level. I remember like the desert world in um, level three is a little hard, but uh, not level, not level, world four. Uh, yeah, shield pretty simple. Apparently, definitely has more annoying missions to do, so that's gonna be fun. Uh, I mean, let's be fair, most of this is going to be a pretty smooth ride. I didn't even know there was a ramp off there. <laughs> Whoa, 
Lucky, you live in that portal where Sheila's from? I do, I do. I live in the land of mountain goats and kangaroos. Yeah, you really have to time the, uh, the landing on this one. Just a little bit. That's, I didn't want to go into first person camera. Ah, home at last. Here, I was saving this to make an omelette, but I think you deserve it more. Ooh. Hi. Hi, Ruby. Uh, good to see you. Yeah. In this game, is going to give me grief. I don't think too much. I'm playing about the Bentley boxing mission, but for it being that that, uh, that difficult, we did just take a hit from Moose. Yeah, we'll just we'll, we'll kill one of the innocent forest critters. Look at that! Look at this poor guy. Boop! Now he's dead. No, look, bruh! I was too busy admiring the environment. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. Uh. Cool, hello, hello Rhinox sir, how we doing? Oh yeah, so, if you haven't played the game, go play it, it, it it's fantastic. Definitely like, I think, the strongest Spyro entry. I mean, that's why it's on this top 100 list, because it is the strongest entry. Um, I mean, some people would argue number two. But I think number two is not as strong. I think, like, there's definitely more refined in this game. There's number two. I think it makes sense, right? Hey, Sheila, let's play a joke. Take this egg and smash it on Billy's house, okay? I need to get him back for the last time he butted me off the cliff. Goats do not like people. <laughs> We do have the Reignited Trilogy. Looked solid. Definitely very solid. Yeah, all three games got just a beautiful makeover. Like, I, that's the thing. I'm not even, like, I keep getting hit by these mooses because I'm just not paying attention. Get out of here, dude. Those Rhinox have taken over. There'll be no stopping them unless we can smash their huts. They're too big to smash with your kick attack, though. Try using your stomp attack to smash them instead. I'll cut. You remember how to stomp, don't you? Just jump. I'm doing that, man. Is that goat German? Uh, yeah, because they're mountain goats, and we all know that only Germans live on mountains, and no one else. We're gonna do some gem rattling up. Rattling up. Uh... Alright. I was ready for you this time. See, I'm not, I'm not getting captured. In the magic of this game, I am actually. I, I'm, I'm having such a good time already. I'm already. Oh, this is the first world, but I'm like already having an infinitely better time than playing Psycho Six. Oh. <laughs> it's just it's nice to play a good game for once. I love playing bad games for like the the reaction and um, you know stuff I get from streaming, but just. Playing a good game on stream is nice too. Yeah, man. Um, yeah, just, just really, really nice. Though, I was looking into the next bad video game that I'm going to be playing. I was either thinking Bubby 3D or Finny the Fish. I would have to buy either of them. And that's really sad. I really don't want to have to pay for a bad video game. Uh, I know I own Sonic 06, but that was my younger self being like, yeah. 
don't seem to like them. Like? I don't know, I actually played the goddamn thing. Alright. Okay, we've, we've dosh gone. Dosh diddly darn done it. We've missed a couple gems. Not that goat. That, that goat was Irish. This is like the FEOVA where all the characters have different accents. <laughs> Look, some goats are Irish, some goats are German. And the kangaroo is Australian. We're going hunting for gems. Where have I missed? If you ever forget how to control Thank you, thank you, Zoe. That's not what I was looking for. Where where the be the gems? Probably got captured in the environments again and missed them. I wish I could help you there. Hopefully they're cheap on your end. Uh, they didn't look to be pricey, so that's fine. Oh, here's a boulder I missed. We missed a five gem, I reckon, somewhere. A nice purple busted. Where is the purple gem? Tell me, oh wise bread. Where is the purple gem? Where has it gone? What has it done with its life? Did it, did it get married? Did it have children? Did it go fight in, in the war? These things I need to know. purple gem. Where art thou? Mm. Okay, well we've gone back through the level and we haven't seen it. That's always a good sign. Just came inside and oh, that was a little quote from me earlier. But I've really missed a purple gem. It's two greens and in red. It could be that too, but who knows. I feel like there's like a wall slot somewhere I have to kick in. Uh, oh, no, there it is. Found it! It was hiding behind the corner. Classic purple gem. Hiding behind the corner. Alright, that's our first world done. Easy. Now we're gonna go skateboards. You want to go skateboards? For the help, Sheila. Oh, you can have this egg I found in my house. Man. Man. We will have Hunter potentially telling us how bad we are at. <laughs> at skateboards. Now, PS2 is backwards compatible, right? You could play PS1 games on your PS2. I feel like I know the answer to this. But I just haven't done it in a long time, so I can't remember. Because Bubsy 3D, surprisingly, is not on anything but its the original PS1 debut. You know, such a shame being its uh, amazing quality cell. Be sure. Yeah. Yeah. So the thing about, um, like, playing Sonic 06 is I, I was like, I need to hit, like, the two-hour mark to get, like, a decent, like, amount of content done, and then I'm just done, because I don't want to play this game more than necessary. Um... But with this game, I'm just gonna play until I I, I, I don't want to play anymore. Oh my, oh my! Can you help us? Hordes of ferocious rhinox have overrun our town and kidnapped the mayor. Oh, that sucks for you. Did I have, like the most piss weak rhinox ever? You lost to them? Oh, they hit the wall. That's that's awesome. 
I don't remember them doing that. These guys actually hit me. Well, I just kill this guy. Daddy, he's just terrified. Purple little cretin, what's he gonna do to me? That. God, I would live in Sunnyville. Look, like, this is a nice little place. You may live free. We showed those two bullies. If they had Jesus. outnumbered me two to one, I'd have finished them off ages ago. Yep, okay, you uh you keep living the lie, my dude. You keep living the lie. Well the PS2 is designed to be backwards compatible, but apparently there are a few games that won't play. Okay, well that'd be really funny. If I needed to buy a PS1 for the sole purpose of playing PUBG 3D. <laughs> wouldn't that just be sad? No, I wouldn't mind re-owning a PS1 again. God, I love that they bump into things. That's great. Hang on, hang on. There's, there's a pot over here I missed. If you'll excuse me. Thank you for waiting. I will come kill you in a moment. Oh, these guys have facial expressions. Look at their facial expressions. It's like, I'ma hit ya. I'ma hit ya. That would be hilarious, not gonna lie. But I didn't see Bubsy on the list. I better double check. I wonder when you hit them off the edge of the PS1, they make it like, Arr! I can't wait to say what can possibly go wrong every two seconds because the platforming is going to be so garbo. I think how long of a game it actually is. I feel like how shitty it is. They've only done like, what, five worlds or something? Called it a day. I honestly hope to god that is the case. It's like, no, actually, there's like 16 worlds. Look, look how much content we've given you. That'd be, that'd be awful. I would hate life. The thing with the bad games lists, if it gets so bad, I probably won't play it. Like, my, my mission is to try and finish, like, every game that I play. There's going to be some instances, I reckon, where it's just not going to be possible without me losing my sanity. Now, we will go do Sheila's segment after I've done the main area. I think it's everything. Hi, Spyro. Each time a fairy zaps you, like... It means your progress has been saved. If you get into trouble, you'll return to the last place you got zapped. I like how there's that little cutscene there, just to just to tell you how those big guys were getting those giant chicken legs. In case you didn't figure that out for yourself. Whoa, I'm dizzy. That's that's nice. You less dizzy now that I've killed the rhino. Do you want to thank me? Do you want to give me an egg? You want to lay an egg for me? You're a bear, right? That's what bears do. They lay eggs. Thanks or a lion. For what, what I you? think I could have worn him down sooner or later. Well, he didn't want to lay an egg for me. That, that's unfortunate. Pretty sure that's what bears and lions do anyway. 
No, Bubsy. It lists why each game can't be played on PS2, bugs, crashes, etc. And some of them crash in the final boss fights or late in the game. It suck. Yeah, I can imagine. That would be quite awful. I can imagine that list would be too extensive, though. I don't remember hearing about any of, like, the really popular games being like, you can't play this. Thank you for rescuing our town. As mayor, I awarded you with one of our famous giant chicken eggs. There it is. I'm sorry. That was the ugliest chicken I've ever seen. Ow. That's I'm sure that's racist in some in some regard. You heard it here, folks. Bears, it's like lion things. What are they? Are they lions? Um, because I know there's a skill point for burning all the trees. I've burnt all the trees. Ooh, I did not want. I was almost exited the level accidentally. I don't really care that much about the skill point. So we're just gonna continue on. Relatively short list considering the overall library. Yeah. Um, so the list is still in its like first draft. Uh, I do need to go and clean up the list. Um, there's just like a couple sequels in there that I don't think need to be in there. Um, I want to like change around the entries a little bit so I'm not playing like, you know, five FPS's in a row and stuff like that. Um, like I want to try and make it as varied as possible. Not, not to mention just like some franchises that aren't on there yet, that probably should be on there. Like, just because a game doesn't get like super high doesn't mean like it shouldn't be represented on, on, on this list. So, I need to just go and consider a couple things and end up doing that tomorrow. That, like, generally I think, like, a good 90 games on that list are, like, finalised. Like, they're definitely going to be on there. Um, but there's certainly a few that just need to be tweaked. Uh, I don't want to really worry about gems uh, while I'm doing the skateboard. That's why I'm doing the gems in there. There's a cheater, right? Is it a young cheater? That's a great question. It kind of looks a bit like this, though. This is where Hunter came from. He actually came from the Greek villas. Oh, you want to go skateboards? Can't wait to do the one that's like all tricks all the time. Oh, oh no, man, I crushed my skateboards. Look at that, this level is that. There's like three sections with gems, so you gotta hope you don't miss one. Like, there's the Sheila section after this, so that's gonna be a bit rough in case I missed a gem somewhere. I think I've gotten everything in here, at least. Um, uh, I think... This one is just kill lizards, right? There's nothing else to do with this level. I think it's just kill lizards. There's, like, two eggs. I think it's, like, kill, like, five lizards and then, like, fifteen. Under a time limit. Hey, Spyro. I found this gladiator training arena that also makes for a pretty cool skate park. Care for a test of your boarding skills? I bet you can't catch all fifteen lizards running around here. Just come back if you want some boarding tips from the master. Oh, I guess it's 15 to 15. Uh, yeah, one zone doesn't have a time limit. Shit, what would the word? Oh, I was like, where did he go? It's not too hard. This is, I mean, this is the first world. They can't make anything too hard. But it was always the skateboarding segment, though. It was a little bit harder than the rest of the game. So 
really sensitive. They've definitely ramped up the sensitivity on those controls. Oh, that is so sensitive. Ah. Oh. I think like I gotta do it without crashing, so that's gonna that's gonna take some getting used to. Oh god, that is really sensitive. Well, it's one chain from the PS1 I don't I don't like. Similar thing with uh, people's complaints um, in Crash 3, like the the jet board control. I don't know. I, I haven't played the fully uh, Crash 3 um, stuff yet. It's the only one I haven't played yet, um, and uh, I might not play it until it uh, pops up later in this list. Um, like yeah, people are like, no, the jet board control kind of suck. Like a lot worse. This is unfortunate. Oh, I missed. Ah! Fine. Yeah, I've missed two. There's one up there. I think I know. I really have to go this way. Oh. No, I think I can go up here. What a bunch of Oh, there's the last two. What? Alright, with that! Okay, we're fine. Yeah, I think I have to go without crashing and under a time limit. Hey, that was great! And while you were boarding, I found this in a lizard burrow. You just found a gladiator ring? Kind of too many of those laying around. What do you You just go down the street and there it is, a gladiator ring. Uh, they were everywhere, you know. People gotta get out of their frustration somehow. Yo, Tony Hawk? It, it is Tony Hawk. Tony Hawk's Pro Skater 6? <laughs> Give it all to right. me. If you can catch all the lizards before time expires without wiping out, I might be able to scrounge up another egg. It's not gonna be easy, though. Hunter's just a hoarder. Like, the world's at stake, he's like, do my skateboarding challenge, Spyro. <laughs> That's the only thing I gotta be careful about is the is just the lizard section. Way to go! There he is. Alright, we'll just we'll go in here next. Plenty of time to do this. That's the thing. Like the only thing we really got to worry about is just wiping out. We've just sort of got a hang of the the control now, so it shouldn't be too bad. Dodge me! Oh shoot! Get back here! Get back here! Get back here! God. Bruh, he 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 shmooved out of the way. Okay, go. Borbman? It is. It's him. Classic Borbman. Okay. Um, oh, that was close. Uh, we've just got this one, and then the two up the top. I missed both of them. That was so embarrassing. Oh no, I got one. I got I got one of them. Okay, all right, it's fine. It's less embarrassing now. Oh! I just ran into that wall. All right, I'm done. Let's try. Oh, that was sweet. And look, there was another egg in the lizard burrow. Zindari. I 
Alrighty. Um, now we've just got Sheila's segment to do. Then we're done another one. Oh, and even the load times are just so quick. Oh, it's so beautiful. This is a beautiful game. I love it. Oh, see, I missed the two gem here. That would have crushed me. I would have been looking around for that for ages. I know what I missed. I missed the flying segment up there. God, see, I'm bad at this game. What am I doing? Something I've got. Um, I gotta warp up here. Risk visuals do make it a little harder. Um, not in a bad sense to see the gems. That's because they, they, like, the environment is as bright as the gems are. Um, they want that ten gems. I think I was meant to fly, yeah, I need to, I need to go back. I just saw gold, and I was like, ooh, shiny. Dragon sounded like a whiz robe from Majora's Mask. A whiz robe from Majora's Mask. That's probably the tree I've missed. Get one? Hey. That's the thing I haven't done in this game, is all the skill points. You have no half of them. Yeah, they only give you a life, so like, like, there's no point doing them. I definitely know a couple of them. Now we can go do Sheila's segment. And hopefully have all the gems. Then we live happily ever after in Sunny Villa. We're not playing the rest of the game. We're going to retire here. Bring some dragon magic back to Sunny Villa. We're going to go through each world and say if we'll live there. So I would live in Sunny Villa. Hey That's, Spyro, it's there nice. are Rhinox everywhere. Maybe I can find some peace and quiet at the top of this tower. Alas. I have lost my love. She's being guarded by evil Rhinox at the top of yonder tower. Can you rescue her for me? You guys have even Sunny Villa. There's a too sunny for you. They're in the tent. Too much sun. I'm actually allergic. I think it's a mountain. How about that? He was a ping ding. So, yep, that's, that's all I got for that Rhinox. God, that acts like there's even a crunch. There's a crunch to kicking them. It feels good. Oh, they just get wrecked. And you're like, ha, nerd. Look at you, gladiator armor. Who do you think you are? Russell Crowe? If I keep hitting the end of that. Boing. No, that's... No, no. Oh damn, I was hoping to kick him off and he sort of just landed on the rocks. Right up on the rocks. Sounds like a good drink, I'd drink that. I knew I'd I was like, there's something I'm missing. I know there is. And this guy. Not entertained. That 
that's it. That's 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 it. That's the reference. Everybody gets one. I think that's it for this area. Except that red gem! The red gem! Oh, sorry, did I say gem? Gems don't exist. It's a red gem. Alright, now we go back to climbing the towers. Watch a speedrun of this game. Like, a 100% speedrun? Like, the movement you would do with Sheila, I'd, I would love to see that happening. Make sure I've got everything. It's gonna be a little cray cray. Hang on a second, pink lion person. I'm just gonna collect the gems, don't mind me. Oh, I knew this would happen. I'm gonna have to comb through like all three sections now. What? Marco sent you here. I've got a restraining order against him. Oh, look look at look at her. Just Look at my nails. Oh. oh! This is gonna be the death of me. Missing one gem. Gem! One gem is missing. One lonely gem. I don't know if it's necessarily Sheila's segment, but that's what worries me. What segment have I missed this one red gem? We're gonna just comb the top of the tower. Oh my god, I keep bopping my head. Keep giving myself concussion. Okay, the tower is sort of clear, but I will go through it layer by layer. Alright, this is what's going to add time to the stream. <laughs> where is the one red gem? Tell me. Tell me where it is. I feel like I've missed it in Spyro segment. I feel like I've missed it in Spyro segment. Just, I just get that feeling, you know? Oh, oh, I almost just died. Oh my god. That would have been embarrassing. There's gonna be one red gem in a corner somewhere. Interesting. I'm just gonna comb every nook and cranny. Make sure I haven't missed it. I definitely feel like it's gonna be in, in Spyro segment. Not even the skateboarding, just something I've missed in the overworld somewhere. I feel like I've pretty thoroughly cleared this area. Yeah, alright. Um, let's go check Spyro signal. I can always save this for later, but it will irk me missing one gem. Gem. Missing one gem. Alright. Where is it? Where is the little busted? At least it's red, so when I do eventually spot it, um, I'll know it's there. Let's try the entrance. No frog! 
Vabbè. Um, let's try the foresty area. The fun. The area where there's probably a gen. Oh, hi, hello, big chicken. I see you've come back to life. You do that often. Look, a chicken turned up. I hope it's not the only one left. I don't want to kill it. Just to be evil. You know, if it's the only one left, it doesn't want to be the only one, you know? We might as well make them extinct. Oh, near, near. Mm. Where are you? Where are you? <laughs> the good thing about Fire Emblem, the world's, like, huge. So you never have to, like, go from, like, one area of the map to the other area of the map. This huge area. Yeah. Not down here. Did you notice he was wearing a toga? They're lions in the Gladiator Coliseum. Yes, they are wearing a toga. They are wearing a toga. Okay, well it's not here. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, hmm. Okay. Well, this might be harder than I thought. Look, after like another five minutes, if I don't find it, uh, I'll come back later when I have the sparks like point me towards the gem power up. I know! You don't have to tell me I've played this game like 1,000 times. There it is! I see it! Got it. Alright, now we can leave. Hell yeah! Well, at least we solved the mystery. But the real mystery, would you live in Sunny Villa? You need to you need to tell me if you live in Sunny Villa. Would you live with the lions and, and the giant chickens? I need to know. We need to rate this on our tier list of places that are livable in Spyro 3. 8 out of 10? Is it 9 out of 10? Tell me, I need to know. Is it a 1 out of 10? Too many lines. Too many gladiator rings. Too many skateboards. They'd probably eat me. If they're peaceful, then yeah. I see. I see. I mean, they're really tiny, to be fair. Look out, Hunter. It's the scary sorceress. I warned you already. This place isn't safe for small dragons and pussycats. Oh, thanks, but I think we can look after ourselves. Try looking after this. <laughs> Come back when you finish witch school, okay? Say... Is it just me, or is she kind of cute when she's angry? Yes, they have a thing going on. That's, that's, that's the storyline. What this seems to be of, is Bianca the size of a cheetah, or is Hunter the size of a bunny? Um, well look, let's, let's, let's take it like to scale, right? Here's a tree, right? This would be a normal sized tree. You, as a person, you know, are probably, like, up to here on the tree, right? Like, where's, where Spyro's jump. Like, that, that sounds reasonable, right? And that's where Hunter is. So you're, you're about as large as Hunter is. As tall? Not as large, just as tall. I'm using incorrect measurement scales. So, like, look. You know, we would be much larger. We could, we could like, hunt the little lion cubs. They are that small. They're the size of a football. A normal sized tree, bro. <laughs> normal sized tree, that looks kind of normal to me. 
Is it? It might be a little tall, sure, but like, it's a pretty normal looking tree to me. Looks like a banana tree, actually. Not a lucky size tree. That's that's a plant. <laughs> what do you mean? I think you guys are crazy. That's that's that is a tree. That is a regular banana tree. You cannot convince me otherwise. Hunger is a normal cheater, and the rabbits are gigantic. Yes. Ah, yes, Cloud Spires. This one has banging music. Okay, I need to turn this up a little bit. Just, just, just give me like two seconds. The music is very quiet. I think I can turn this game. Board to turn this game up a little bit. Hang on, I just need to make sure this is not being picked up in the mic. Yeah, it's not being picked up at mic. Ah, cool. God, you look. The Rhinox have shut down our cloud generator, and I may never see a rainbow again. God, you you look creepy. I'm sorry, but you look creepy. They they definitely changed that one for not not the best. Oh, the music for this one is so good. Let's think about it, this game has like the best soundtrack out of all three, easily. I don't think we're raving the guy. I think we're done. Let's let's bump that. Oh, see so how yeah, we just made that? If my wings were big and strong like yours, I could easily glide across here. I'm gonna murder you and your son. That's that's the look she's giving me, and I don't like it. Look at these dudes with a lightning bolt. Alright guys, uh, now that we've seen a little bit of Cloud Spires, would we live in Cloud Spires? Um, look, I'll be honest, it looks a little bit too Himalayas for me. And getting around would be quite the pain, um, considering I can't fly. So I can't say I would want to live in Cloud Spires. Hang on. I know the pick of Spire on the left is the pause screen is running. Um, but I like to imagine the back legs being the front legs and having jacked shoulders. <laughs> God, I, oh, now I see it. Oh, that's terrifying. It's like, oh! Don't ask me what that denizen is because I have no freaking clue. <laughs> Where do I charge my phone? Um... That's the thing, they probably don't have power outlets. It's it's like a very Himalayas esque area, you know? The metal armor those enemies That's are wearing crazy. You protect? mean I gotta charge them with my horns? The thing that I've already been doing? Bruh. I can't believe they'd suggest such a bold, foolish plan. Hit the thousand gem mark. Let's go. I think we have to pay money bag in this level. It's so crunchy. I love how crunchy it is. Whoops, that. Hmm, <laughs> yeah, I don't think I could do all that flying. Right? Good thing I came back. I missed a, another red gem. Stephanie! Stephanie! 
<laughs> that was a really dirty look. <laughs> See? Oh, man. Plus side, sick mountain biking. Downside, no KFC. Oh, that is, that is, that is a huge downside. I can't see him having a KFC here. Although there is little birds here, so I don't know. You could make some wicked wings out of them. Like, let's let's look at this little bird for a second. You could make some KFC out of that. Why? Nice looking wicked wing out of that. God, he's weird. Face, the face on it. Um. Oh yeah, the previous world had KFC. True, it did have a very big KFC. A single wicked wing. <laughs> It's better than no Wicked Wings, to be fair. Oh, my God. Right, screw livability. Does the world have access to KFC? I mean, that's the fact. Oh, right. See, we gotta pay money back. Well, well. If it isn't my favorite dragon, the sorceress has put me in charge of guarding these bellows. However, I might look the other way if I was distracted. Counting gems. Here is money bags. Oh, yes. Precious, precious gems. Well then, Spyro, you may now use the bellows anytime you wish. Best of luck on your little egg hunt. <laughs> yes. Um, can I make it up here now? Is, is that something I'm allowed to do? Yeah. No, I think I've got to finish the world before I'm allowed to go up there. Oh, I see that, mate. That was a sick jump. Sick, nasty with it. <laughs> Alright, ready to dive on this guy. This guy, he's going off the mountain. Yes. Remember, to get your longest glide, press the jump button at the very top of your jump. And we know, the... we've played platforming before, Spire games before. Remember, money bags is the real villain. That is true. That's so true. This game does give you the satisfying uh, conclusions of the money bag side of that. A very, very satisfying conclusion. Have a bit more of a freak out about it. Oh god, oh I'm going up. Right. Uh, you know what? Sure, we'll do this. We'll do this side quest now. We usually wake up our rain cloud at the crack of dawn. But these mysterious the rain's on the top of here? No thanks. I like the rain, but there's no like good indoors areas. Where am I meant to put my bed? Where am I meant to put my fire emblem collection? Ah yes, the classic egg thieves. Oh what? Okay, you can't squeeze through there. Spyro is too thick. Okay, we'll do another lap just for you, my little egg thief. 
Let me just try to go through there again. I forgot he cut, sort of cuts. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh, no, no! Don't go the other way. I forgot how annoying egg thieves tend to be. You get so close, yet so far. You know what? I'm not even going. I might as well go down here. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Got him. If that hurt. So I wasn't born with the glasses? Do glasses occur in the womb? Organic glasses? That sounds kind of gross. Uh, let's make sure we clean this area of gems before we do the, the challenge of the day. Which I'm sure is a very tough challenge. So gems up there. But gems over there. Gems here, gems there, gems everywhere. <laughs> Apparently. Yes. Organic glasses. <laughs> you know about organic? Metroid Prime? Great game. Uh, yeah, I was like, I, I did the first playthrough and then I was like, you know, I'm gonna play it again. Fuck. There wasn't really much change to hard mode, sadly, other than enemies being like bullet sponges. But you know, it was it was probably a better way to play because it's Metro Prime is a pretty easy game. There's like no real like tough part. There's like one part that makes me a little nervous to play, um, but with like some proper. Ah, uh, preparation, it's easy. So why did the clouds have faces? Do you want this doodad? It fell out of the belfry. Jake! Jake from Advance Wars. Howdy. Uh, right. I guess we shall go down. Alright, we need to clear the rest of this world. Uh, the top of this world. Let's let's do that. I know the place I'm gonna go. I oh, see there's some Renox up there. Some Renox. So banging. Oh, did you see that epic maneuvering I just did? Oh, that was beautiful. It was golden. Oh, like this. I was spitting fire. Like these guys. Jump over this. Okay, cool. Good to know. Um, I'm gonna get Ubi here. I think that does it for overworld gems. Now I've got one more area to go to. Yeah, red feet. Got another organic glasses. What if you try to take them off? I'm, I'm asking questions. I probably don't want to know the answer to. All natural glass. Does make me. Um... Our sun has gone out. We can make a new one with our lava fusion cauldron and three sun seeds, but they keep burning out before we can get them in the pot. Step on the switch to get a fresh sun seed and keep cleaning it until you get it into the pot. Okay, all I heard in this pot. I think these guys are into pot. 
Alright, this game should be rated, uh... What's the, what's, what's the mature one? Is it, is it, like, M for you guys? Mature. It's the drug references. Drugs in my Christian Spyro game? I think not. Bro, his face too. Ew. Ew. I wanna... I don't wanna picture that. It was gross. Up oh, there. Yeah, I see you. I see you there. Yeah, it's M for us. What is it for you? Um, MA is the, is the... I mean, there's M as well, but that's like... Uh, that's like mature with parental guidance sort of thing. Like, there are themes in here, but it's too bad. But the one that's like more like, oh, there's the violence and the drug references, they're getting pretty bad, is the MA. Alright, we've got all of the gems. Excellent. Now we can focus on doing the sun. The sun! Yahoo! Alright, keep, keep on going. Keep on going, Buckaroo. Wahoo indeed. I think it may as a rank up from M, and then it goes to A. Yeah, for us it goes from M to MA to R. Listening to the music, I'm like, damn, this music is fire. <laughs> Get it? Cause that the sun seed is lit. Oh, it's starting to disappear very quickly. The, the Tiki level, the underwater level, Let's get, and then the speedway. They can't 100% play Tiki level because they don't have Sergeant Bird. Right, I'm going to quickly get a drink because my throat is starting to get a little dry. So I'm ready to go. What the heck? Did I yawn a breath of fire? Oh great. Um, there can be a condition in Spyro where, well, where the glasses fail to grow with the dragon and the head outgrows and squeezes out the glasses and the dragon goes blind either from the small glasses jabbing into the eyes and damaging them or because the small glasses are misaligned. Bruh. Bruh. This is going a bit too deep. The law. Um. Yeah, let's do the teal. At last, my portal is working again. Come visit me at the Tiki Lodge. Tiki Lodge? I'll come visit you at the Tiki Lodge. Hang on, I'm trying to do one hand.
The lore is getting too deep. It's getting too deep! I think there's something like 25,000 gems in this game. Entering the molten crater. This one also has good music. Unfortunately, there are two egg thieves, and I don't like those. Yes, we'll let you talk. Rhinox are running rampant around here, but I can't get anyone out of the Tiki Lodge long enough to do anything about it. I do miss the original voices. Oh, okay, wait, the whole Warhog's evil. Okay, uh, I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> we have to remember there's a chest back there. Really quick attack. I'm sorry, Flamingo, you must die. Flamingo had to go, guys. I'm so sorry. And that flower? Screw that flower. Flowers can't live next to lava anyway. What are they doing? Ready? We're gonna dive on this guy. Charge! Easy. Got him. I never saw it. An OG of the dragon. Was Spiritomb Kenny, Elijah Wood, or someone else? Um. SpongeBob. He was SpongeBob. I think. Yeah, yeah. He was SpongeBob. Riki! Uh, I don't know, Riki. I know, Riku. Double checking. Have I missed anything? Nope. All right, let's continue on. We will have an odd gem counter anyway, unfortunately for us. Be sure to keep your friend Sparks the Dragonfly healthy, Spyro. If his health is low, torch a little creature like the slug below me to release a butterfly. Like he said, I was like, <laughs> oh god, they're talking about me. Why are they talking about? Me? And I'm missing. I'm cringe! I'm so cringe! I can't hit this guy! Here we go. Ah. It's fine, you recovered. Eyes. The eyes of... That's the eyes of someone who's seen some shit. Not hard, so aggressive. Oh, there's a... Skid over there. I will grab that basket in a moment. What? Here, take this ick. They were giving them away at the Tiki Lodge last night. So would you live here? Oh, right. True, true. Um, look, I'll be honest, maybe a bit too much lava for my liking. You know, I could be going for a walk, trip and, like, literally burn my face off. Don't know if I want to do that, I'll be honest. I'd have to say, that's a no from me. This is nice though. That's green grass for somewhere that's so surrounded by molten lava. But can you plug your phone in here? Um, judging by all the stone structures, I'm going to say probably not. Yeah, I, I, I didn't forget about you, Vasu. Forget about you. Done. We'll find somewhere you can plug your phone in, don't worry. It's just not the Tiki Lodge. The Tiki 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 Lodge. 
Okay. It's Munir Bags. He's back again, the bastard. Spyro, you're just in time. I saw two egg thieves run through this door. Well, actually, they paid me to guard their hideout, but that's irrelevant. I'll happily let you through the gate to chase them down for a small finder's fee. Thank you, Spyro. And best of luck catching those dastardly egg thieves. He, I know someone named Tiki. That be. I hope it's no dragon. Dragons are cringe. We don't like playing as dragons. Are you the dragon looking for all those eggs? Because I saw a shifty looking character with one over there. Why are they South African? Why are the Tiki South African? Don't understand. No bags is based on a prostitute. He'll do anything for money. <laughs> uh, that's a good tent. I like that. Alright, you ready to... Oh, I forgot to do the key thing. Oh, that's fine. We'll be right. Alright, we're gonna... Maybe I want to do like a... Wait, like, what? Alright, let's go... Let's... Hey, no, Moneybags needs to activate the charge pad first. That's right. I don't like us having four digits. The best. He's the government. He'll never let us have any money. I think I've gotten all the gems. We're gonna have like a really awkward number now for until we get Sergeant Bird. Now let's go. We got things. I'm just gonna grab all this stuff on the way over. Don't mind me, Egg Thief. I will catch up to you. Just like. Let me grab the gems. This one takes a while. We are catching up to him, just slowly. These guys want with eggs. Are these like black market dealing where it's like, yes, I will fetch a pretty pet for these dragon eggs. So close, I can almost taste it. There we go. Moira? Oh, Moria? Another Resident Evil character. Let's go. Now, where's Barry? That's what I want to know. Just have to wait until you cut enough corners. There goes another one. He was really fast. Maybe if I activate the supercharge, you'll be able to catch him. I'm not chasing after you yet. I've got things to do. Like, at the skill point. We can... I got, I got stuck on a rock. Oh, I'm still stuck on a rock. Ah, oh, so cringe. like the same turn. Oh. Oh. Ow, there's a rock wall there. There's, there's also there's also a rock wall there. Walls here. No spider for concussion. Oh, that would have been epic! 
Oh man! I almost just like outmaneuvered him by cutting the Omega corner. Bruh, bruh, bruh! <laughs> oh, this is so hard. Why is this so hard? I, I suck. I just, I literally suck. That's what it is. It's, it's a skill issue. Actually, really tough. A little bit of slow down didn't help me there. Oh my God, it's so easy to bump into a wall. Him. Bruh. Bruh. I passed him. Skill. Come to another wall. This is too much of a shot down. suck at this. Let's go. I thought I missed him again. I was like, ah, shit. No, it's fine. I got him on decent. Well, that was a bit tough, but we did it. Alright, we're pretty much done with this one. We need to go grab that chest. Um, there is an exit for there. like it's just you and me. I'll keep a lookout while you sort out the Rhinox. Okay, that's that's great. I already did that. But thank you though. Oh no, look at that unsatisfying number. 91? I'm gonna be stuck with a 91? God. That's terrible. I burnt I burnt it myself. Was painful. Onto the water world. Then we're onto the speedway. So I'm having a great time. This is a fantastic game. I'm curious, um, the next entry though. It's gonna be a bit of a big adventure, I reckon. That's gonna be quite a Your few streams. Camera is currently in passive, if you like. Oh no, we okay. stop skiing me. Yay! My portal is working.
working. I'll see you at the beach. A beach. Um, yeah, it's gonna be a bit of a long one because it's one of the, it's one of those famous RPG franchises. But it's uh, never played one. But it's gonna be, it's gonna, it's gonna be a while. Just know it's gonna be a while. We got to do the submarine mission and some other things, the Sheila mission in this one. While I was gone, my friends borrowed the Rhinox submarine. Then they took it for a joyride. And then they smashed it into a big pile of rocks. Oddly enough, the Rhinox failed to see the humor in their actions and stuck my friends in the jail cell behind you. Justifiable. Hey. And, then, and then I don't blame the Rhinox. I don't blame the Rhinox at all. They stole their vehicle, then they crashed it. I mean, I'd be pissed too if someone stole my car and then they crashed it. Uh, a lot of water. Uh, I think I've pretty much gotten everything. Okay, let's... Skilled. How did you get it, like, in there at that angle? How did they do that? Can someone tell me how they actually managed to crash it? They, it looks like they, like, shoved it between the rock and the house. How did they do that? Pretty skillful, they ask me. Yeah, I'm sorry, I crashed your car. Damn it! Oh, I missed. Bridge. Fourteen lives already, bro. If you want a quick summary of your progress in a world, you can press the guidebook button to open the guidebook page for the world you're in. Wall collision detection. I got to try to run into me. <laughs> Okay, would we live in the... What's this level called? Seashell Shore. There we go. Would we live in Seashell Shore? Oh! Alright, oh, now we charge these ones, don't we? I was like... Wait, what am I doing? I thought I'd jump over to that one. Correct. Jason! It's Jason! 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 I think you cried those... Kind of tears on the water. Kind of kill for you ask me. This, this, oh, this level's got a lot of skill. A lot of weird things happen. How much swimming is required for someone who lives here? Um, I would say. A fair amount. That. Man, now I can platform again? Mm. I mean, it depends. I suppose it depends what area of Sea Cell Shore you're living in. Like, you could live perfectly nicely on this plateau right here, and you'd be fine. You know, there's also a lot of swimming if you want to get anywhere. So unless you, like, if you don't want to get something, then you're fine, right? Not a water person, but can doggy paddle if required. Well, look, I think you might need something a little stronger to live contently in, in Seashell Shore. It might not be the area for you. It's nice, it's just, it's a lot of just sand. And it's coarse and it's rough and it gets everywhere. 
actually really don't like sand. I'm sounding like Anakin, but I don't like sand. It, it does get everywhere, and that's... I don't... Feeling of sand. That's what gets me. It feels <laughs> rough and coarse, and it gets everywhere. God, I, I'm just Anakin. Yeah, I'd die out here. <laughs> I'm a false sense of security. Yeah. Just the right angle. Here's a certified bitch. Here's a certificate and everything. He went to bitch studies. You can hover to get more. Has this jumping mechanic we've already told you about three times? How about we tell you about it again? We will come back and do the Sheila segment in a bit. damage this time around. Oh. oh, I missed them all. Cringe. Oh, they're swimming away. Also cringe. Oh, I hit an octopus. That's something. Area appears nice. Yeah, it'd be a nice area if you could breathe underwater. The giant octopuses, though. I don't know how I feel about those. So clearly not native to the land. But, the octopuses would be, right? So, you know, it's, it's, not, it's not super appealing, gotta be honest. More, more gems, I keep saying gems, gems don't exist. It's gems. Love gems. I think we've gotten everything around here, around these parts. Oh, there's not. There we go. My plan worked. That dumb octopus dropped the jail key while he was shaking me. Now I can free my friends. How does an how does an octopus have a jail key? Where is it keeping the jail key? Tell you, one of the Rhinox had this egg in his lunchbox. Busy. Oh god, who would name the child Busy? Asking for trouble. It's quite a headache. <laughs> yeah, <myself. laughs> uh, now we can go do mini games. Let's go do the submarine. Let's go do the submarine first. Then we'll go back and do Sheila's. Because I'm pretty sure there's no gems in the hydro tunnel, so. I just want to get the gems. Bruno, the Rhino we'll meet one one day. Will I? Our speedboat versus his nuclear shark submarine. If we win, we'll get the dragon egg he's guarding. If we lose, we'll have to spend a month doing kitchen patrol. What do you say? Do you want to take on Bluto? 
Oh. Okay, good luck. Just remember, stay away from the sharp end. Okay. I killed the guys. Kill them. Okay, we're maneuvering. What? What did? How did I just get hit? I see. Uh, unfortunately, I started this fight at a at a disadvantage. I would say. I'm not turning this way. I swear I'm not turning this way. Did you see the, all the shots I just got on his ass? I need like one more. Oh my god, these controls are kind of garbo. How do they stuff this up? This control completely fine. Questions being raised while we're playing this, while we're doing this playthrough. Need answers. I think we should demand answers. Those, those purple gems actually blend into the water too much. Right, I'm just going to do a nice quick comb over this area. And let's go on the outside. There's a few, few gems up here. You killed that shark! We're going to write a letter. We are going to write a letter. Is it THQ? Who does this? Uh, Toys for Bob did did the remake. Uh, the original was... Uh, Vicarious Visions? I don't know, I can't remember who did the original. Okay, I think we've got all the gems around here. Do another quick dive under here. Kind of a motion blur, which sort of like. Oh wait, Is that one there. Am I tripping? That might have been sparks. I'm gonna start second guessing myself on it. Oh my god, camera person. Uh, I think we got everything around here. Okay. To convince myself, you know. Oh, see, we did miss one. I'm pretty confident we got all the games. Okay, now we're gonna go to Sheila's segment. friends are trying to take down a Rhinoc fortress. I'm about to go and lend a foot. I love the smell of singed Rhinoc in the morning. Ew. Quite a unique smell. X. Uh... Oh, fuck, fuck that up, didn't I? Oh. 
about this this level, right? So the very first time I 100%ed this game, I was missing some gems in this level. And it I went through this level must like five or six times before like I didn't realize there was this little alcove up here. Now like I was miss it was just like the one egg and the few gems that were up here. But I, I must have been on this level for like an hour just looking for it, and I just couldn't find it. I always remember to come up here. Every single time. That. Okay, here's another question. Where did the seal get the build a fortress the on our beach, and we're going to blow it to smithereens. We just need you to take out all the turrets for us. We're lighting the bomb now, so just make sure to stomp all those turrets before the fuse runs out, okay? Okie dokie. I think definitely quite a bit different. There's some like changes that are messing with me because I know the PS1 version so well. Not like huge differences, but like the submarine, that just works so differently and in a worse way as well. Like, I'm like, freak is this control? But uh, submarine looks a lot less aggressive. They bamboozled you, they shot it. Wow! I can't believe I survived that blast! It's a good thing I kept this egg nice and safe in my pocket. It's Molly! God, Molly's looking a little cray cray. Gems. Get some health. Kill the the ducks with Water helmets on? The ducks! They can breathe air! What are you guys doing? I, I feel like we've missed something. There's 91, right? So we're missing like two green gems, maybe? I had to guess. Probably in the main area of Spyro Sigma. Definitely easy to miss. Um, I think we're good here. I mean, often stream is like, okay, what gem have I missed? What gem, sorry, what gem have I missed? I don't think we got everything here. It's probably in Spyro's main area. We'll do another come over. Um, let's just search around town. If I had to guess, it's probably two green gems I've missed. Camera's a little annoying at times, but that's okay. It's a platformer. I feel like cameras are never perfect in platformers. Oh wait, there's a shell here. Oh, there's one. Yeah, I was missing one green gem. Another shell. Another shell. I wouldn't be surprised. Eh, not around here. Okay, 
gold. Not in this area, so... Let's check one of the other areas. be a green one, not two red ones, right? There it is. Got it. Alright, now we've just got the Hydro Tunnel. And that's pretty much like all the mandatory first world missions done. I used to have a dragon egg for you. But instead, I used it to test our ultra-high-speed superfluidity tunnel. The good news is that it made it to the end of the tunnel without a scratch. The bad news is that there's no way to get it back out now. The tunnel is chock full of rhinox and floating mines. The only way to retrieve that egg is to defeat every single rhinox in the tunnel. That's a pretty tough one. I have to like hit them all. I have to like know the path thing pretty well. Got a bit lucky. One of the two. You hit a mine, you're done. You miss a rhino, you're done. Oh dang. That was almost first try. I'm glad I helped you figure this out. Baby experimentation. It's fine! Alright. Okay, on to the speedway. God, we, I can't believe we've, already, we've been doing this for two hours already. Doesn't feel like it. I hate that it's 91. It's a very unsatisfying number. It's not good at all. Let's head on over to the balloon. I'm not going on the balloon. I hope you know that, right? You guys can hang there for a while. I'm gonna go do the speedway level. Yay! Mushroom speedway! It's amazing how time flies when you're enjoying yourself. That's so true. God. We are starting this list with such a banger. I'm quite excited because, like, a lot of these games, like, I wouldn't say I've played, like, all 100 of them. Not even close. I'd have to go through, but I feel like I've played about half. Um, I think it's time attack. I'm allowed to explore the level. I'm going to do the hunter mission first. Um, he's, like, right here. He's in like inside one of these mushrooms somewhere. Oh, I think. Yeah, there it is. Whoa! A bunch of sheep and flying saucers just came out of nowhere and started blasting up the race course. Looks like I'll have to hop in my plane and teach him some manners. Look out, sheep! Here I come! No gross hunter, don't do that. Don't, don't tell the sheep you're going to do that. <laughs> Might have screwed that one up. Whoa, a bunch of sheep and looks like a... Look out, sheep! Well, I'll be honest, I wasn't listening to uh, the explanation. I was just like, yep, I'm just going to get into it. What the hell? What just hit me? Whoa, 
You did that wrong. <laughs> and yes, Fox does talk like that. Okay, that's what I got hit by. Oh, fireball hit you. Whoa, yes, the flying like, sheep sources in their fireballs. It just crashed into me. He was like, you're dead. And I was. But I not a good aim. I miss that guy. Crap. Yeah, we're gonna kill this guy over here. This guy is on my shit list. Blowing up the entire racetrack. That's from the sheep, also. What? There's one guy. He's dead. Check it out. The squad leader had abducted this egg. Hey there. Who do we name that child Taylor? Well, I'm a potato! Alright, now we'll do the level. These are always pretty fun. I do enjoy these. It's because they're asking for their homeland to be destroyed. The scooter's turn. So the controls do feel much better on these flying segments for the for the remake. Feel much nicer. Fire flying always felt a little awkward, but uh, not this time. If they didn't want you to blow up the whole track, they shouldn't have given you infinite bullets. So true. So true. I wonder if it's the exact same sound as the PS1 version. It sounds the same. I rip Sabina. Alright, it's time to race the butterflies. I need the hot bean juice. The hot bean juice. Tell me what the hot bean juice is. I'ma get you. I'ma get you. Oh, I love sabotaging other races. Bounced off that rock, but it was fine. I'm glad that counted. <laughs> yes, sabotaging more races. Let's go. Oh, coffee. That hot bean juice, of course. It's almost 8 a.m. Did you get up to watch me? Was it five? It, but gosh, what are you doing? Get out, get out here. Oh, you're lucky. You're lucky. Like right on his ass, just as if this is not hitting him. Bruh. Oh, what? Oh, he hit an invisible wall there. Oh, 
Butterfly. Are we gonna win this? <laughs> I didn't stuff up and like, except for hitting that small invisible wall, that didn't push me back that far, right? Oh, it did! It did! No! Well, I'm on vacation, I can do what I want. You know, that's fair. I can't believe we missed that because we hit one small mushroom. I think that race was this tight. Literally every single speed boost as well, that's the crazy part. Classic mushroom. Always the sabotage. The saboteur is what that mushroom was. You have to be really careful not to hit that mushroom again. <laughs> Different. Did I miss a speed boost on my second lap? Oh no, he's just so fast! These rings sure are generous. Took a risk by going the mushroom route. And somehow it didn't backfire. I'll take it. Let's go! Alright, that's world one. Full, well, almost fully complete. I gotta go do cheeky stuff. John? It's John. I'm going to exit the level. One fourth of the game down. Just gotta beat the boss and then it's pretty much done. The balloon's all ready, sir. Just jump on. Love being sir. This balloon will take you to a land closer to the sorceress, Spyro. You can also use it to come back here whenever you want to. What a convenient balloon. I guess you'll just pop in the balloon now. Uh, don't ask me how it works. I just showed up for the punch and cookies. <laughs> Wait, where are the punch and cookies? There's punch and cookies? I want them. Pop in the balloon whenever you want, Spyro. Thanks, Cumulus. This balloon will take you to the great Tiki Lodge in the sky. Just jump on when you're ready. It sounds like it's taking me to heaven, bro. Alright, I'm gonna quickly get a drink of what the well, it's not the same Listen carefully, you stupid girl. I'm only going to ask you one more time. Why haven't you disposed of that infernal dragon? I, I tried to scare him off, your highness, but he's just not afraid of anything. 
Not afraid? Not afraid? Why have I been training you all these years? Use some magic! Here's a spell. So I did not mean to press that. Whip up a monster and eliminate him! Uh, kill him? I don't care what you do, you useless brat. As long as you get rid of him. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, this ought to do it. You can't keep me caged up in here forever. <laughs> you there, get me out of here. This is unacceptable. You, come here. <laughs> What the devil? Apologies, I need to charge my control a little bit. When I heard that Sorceress was planning to ambush you, I got here as fast as I could. No worries, though. This wussy green toad will be no match for the two of us. I could get cookies. Me too. Bianca is like, but this is rated E. No, it's mature now. Uh. No, he looks scarier with the bunny ears. So true. He needed the bunny ears. Dodge. Oh, look. oh, what? What just happened there? You got me at such an angle. Right, there we go. go. He makes more interesting sounds in the... Bro, what? 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 It's part of the dodge in this game. No, not again. Oh, I'm getting wrecked by the first boss. This is embarrassing. Where he was not like this different. Bruh. No, no, don't you dare. God. Look at your rings of fire, nobody cares. annoying in this bit. There we go. Because in the PS1, you just sort of like ran in a circle. Like I'm doing that, but he catches me. like really tight loops. Is that the idea? Okay, that's the idea. Lame. Yeah, so even the bosses has changed a little bit. Like he never just chased you. He locked on no matter what, but he never really caught up to you if you were charging. Second, I thought she like had my car into the lava. Uh, 
And that's how we got Darth Sheila. Try not to. I'll clean up midday gardens and then I'll go back to where I was sitting. I cannot read chat like this. But also, I need power to my controller. There's pictures now. Interesting. Oh. More pictures. Interesting. I, I, did I, did I get... No, I did not. Okay, Dragon. You've managed to survive longer than I expected. But you haven't the slightest idea what sort of dangers lie ahead of you. I suggest you grab your cat friend and whatever eggs you found and hightail it back home while you still can. I'm telling you this for your own good, you know. My friend's picking up like a tiny bit. That's because the my friend's a bit closer to. That's okay, we'll live. God, I love the music in this game. Blow egg. Dive. Hi, Dive. Especially Bianca. Super cringe. Mm, I see. Ah, oh, I missed it. Still in a charge state. Sergeant Bird level first in this world, just so I can go back and get the good gem count. Mingus, more like Dingus. Ha, <laughs> got him. We'll read chat in a bit, I promise. Once I've cleaned up here and my controller's charged just a bit more. Bit of rock out. Spyro. Zoe told me that if we hit that doodad up there, the portal will open. Why don't you try spitting this rock at it? Um, I need to go in first person. And you picked up a rock. I was trying to, but then you got in the way, Hunter. Grass recovers from fire. Like, yep, okay, I can check off being burnt. Wish I could do that. Ugh, okay, burns off. That's how Pokemon do it. Great question. Alright, there's an egg thief on this level. I forgot. Alright, we'll go kill you. That one's an easy one. Trixie? More like. 
Dingus. That got him. Oh, uh, free using the bit, Sergeant Bird. I'm just doing shit. I think the one thing, like, having. Like, grafting the pretty of this is that there's some intense motion blur. It's hard to move fast. She's a little unfortunate. The cost of having a very pretty looking game, I suppose. That's crazy, dude. No, no! I didn't want to go to the stupid spooky swamp level. I didn't want to. I didn't. Hunter, he was baiting me. He was baiting me into the ladder. I'll just exit level. Uh, I don't want to do this right now. Level not the greatest level. Great music, but... I wasn't done with Midday Gardens yet. Oh, I can't see. Oh, there's new members of chat. I'm sorry. I'm up here because my control is charging. Well... Oh, best views, no! He's not the best viewer. That's cringe. How are you not the best viewer? Oh my god, it's time to ban. I might well catch up while I'm here. Um, pray soon! Um... Who names their kid Mingus? <laughs> That's right, who does name their kid Mingus? The rocks would be more difficult to spit. Like, imagine clacking at him. Ooh, that sounds painful. I love this place, but now I'm supposed to live here if I crack my teeth on rocks? Only if you want to go to Enchanted Towers. Shred? Swamp? Among Us? Sus? Now I'm the best viewer, I hate the other ones. You are. By default you are the best viewer, congratulations. Anyway, let's get back to Midday Garden collecting. Enough being trolled by Bloody Hunter. Here, if you collect a thing, you'll go into the portal, you'll be sucked right in. That's what he did to me. really cool. Uh, the control, right, it reflects the colour of your sparks health. Which I think is just a really cool thing. Really unnecessary, but dope. Okay, I see the game right there, yes. Thank you for the game. I would live in Midday Gardens. I would very much appreciate Midday Gardens. It's a nice place! Oh look, it's a ladder! Thank god we can climb them! Thank god Hunter could tell us... Modesty? Really? Modesty. More like dingus. <laughs> now we need to go power up with our. Hi, 
Anyway. Yeah, yeah, I know. Thank you. I'm not gonna kill the planters just yet. There's somewhere else I've gotta be. Oh god, I'm headbutting things on all the headbutt. Thank you. Oh, as far as back, that's pretty cool. Uh, well, I didn't get all the gems. Uh, did I go swimming under here? I think I did. But I will double check. Yes, I did. What gem count am I sitting at? Oh, okay, I'm fixing a gold. Um, let's break open the pots and then we'll go gem hunting. Somewhere. Where are you, Gem? Where are you? Oh wait, I've already made this reference. Probably a gold one. Could be two purples. Um, hmm. Interesting. I do not see. I cannot see. Mm. Okay. I think we know for sure now it's not really up here. So I guess we're going back down here. Hmm. Alright. It's back on the hunt for the gems. Um, no, not back here. What about underwater? Hmm. It's not underwater. Where are you? Ah! You? You cannot hide from me. Honestly, you're doing a pretty good job of it. Mm. Uh, we'll check the snow area again. Oh, there they are. This little crevice over here. Yeah, I think that's... Yeah, that's all level. Alright, cool. We shall go back now. Back to sitting next to the computer. Close to the camera. I was, I was. I had to charge my controller. I'm on the ridiculously short PS4 uh, charging cable. God, it's hard not to unsee that Spyro like right now. Yeah, <laughs> next time I get a pet, I need to rem remember the name Mingus. <laughs> yes, please name your pet Mingus. Um, the controller changes color to match sparks. It does. It it does. It's really cool. It's it's just really neat feature. Where do I plug in my phone? Um. Okay, you got me there. Maybe Sergeant Bird can help you out that one. Uh, poor kid is going to be messed up with a name like Modesty. <laughs> Here's my other kids, Chastity and Chivalry. Uh, I even like that pond. I'd keep coy. Yeah. He close yet? He does not know what we say. You're welcome. <laughs> I do now. I see everything. Hear everything. Alright, let's go do Sergeant Bird's level. Ah, my good 
and spider. Can you see him eyeing off money bags? Naughty bird letting off rockets in her fireworks factory, but I'm willing to release him into your custody, provided you pay his outstanding fines. Look at him eyeing off money bags. He's like, I'm, a, I'm gonna kill this son of a bitch. That's, 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 that's the look. That's the look. Or it's the look of, did you did you take my donut out of the fridge? You, you son of a bitch. We'll have the hot bean juice. Excellent. Go for some hot bean juice, but, um, that'd be a bad uh, idea at this time. What a sucker! Uh, that is, it's a far, far better thing you do today, Spyro, uh, than you have ever done. And, uh, well, so forth, etc. You get the idea. Sergeant Bird, 90068. Awaiting orders, sir. Um, I think you'll have to find your commanding officer for that. Hey, what are those things? These are the latest military hardware. DBX-9 rocket launchers, state-of-the-art. So why didn't you use them to escape? Ooh, uh, because, because I have limited ammo, and I wanted to conserve it. For this. <laughs> Say, where'd you come from? I thought dragons had all been dead for a thousand years or something. Well, the rumors of our extinction were slightly exaggerated. We just wanted a little peace and quiet. Well, if it's peace and quiet you want, you should stay clear of my homeworld for a bit. I reckon I'll be blowing up Rhinox for weeks. Cheerio! Huh. Yay! Speaking of blowing up Rhinox, let's do it! <laughs> Assassinate money bag. Yeah. He was assassinated. He was killed. Killed in action. Right, we do this, then we go back to the Tiki Lodge, and we'll have an even gem count once again. Sorry, did I say gem? I meant gem count. I have to train the hummingbirds. They must be in peak physical condition if we're going to take on the sorceries. But his walk is like wacky. Look at that walk. Look at that waddle. So corrupt. It's gotcha. Sir, the situation is this. Yesterday at 1845 hours, the Rhinox invaded. We defended as best we could, sir. But without your leadership, we couldn't put up an effective resistance. By 1900 hours, the rest of the squad was captured, and the Rhinox had complete control of the base. Oh, sounds like the hummingbirds are terrible at their job. Okay. Yeah, well, we, we got a job to do. does walk better than most, you are correct. He also flies better than most as well. Um... Plants at me. Does that? Ah! Who does that? I swear I wasn't close enough, but anyway. Um, I need bombs. Alright, the weights. Sir, I've captured the enemy rations. They won't march far on empty stomachs. It's sick, Freed! <laughs> I've been named Siegfried in the past 20 years. I've the liked it. The Rhinox have blocked the way out of this next cave with a security door. And I don't think you'll be able to blast your way through this one. 
I recommend you land on the weights and carry them to the pressure sensitive security switches on either side of the door. When in position. Oh, thanks. I'm just gonna kill a bunch of people first. Beat him. Oh man. It controls a little weirdly. Uh, the flying is a bit weirder. The missiles are definitely better. The flying is a little different. It's a little awkward. Alright, hang on, let's kill this lady. Drop bombs on these guys, but why can't you just go back? Apparently not. Um, there are gems up here. Oh, what? Hang on, let's see if I can get this guy. I'm curious. Siegfried is a good name, just like who's named their child Siegfried in the last 20 years? I'm generally curious. When he got bonked on the head, the birdie slew around his head. Would that be like having little people run around your head? I guess so. Another one here, I just sort of want to. I feel like I don't know if killing those guys with a skill point or not. I can't remember. Anyway, weights, right? Wait, that's what I'm up here for? Weights? Sergeant Bird presses. How much did he bench press? Apparently quite a lot. Oh, what? Tell me how he dodged that one. I'm... I want to know. Cool people name their kid that. So true. Bruh! <laughs> Justin's cousin's dog is named Siegfried. That's a good dog, man. Bro! Alright, I'm gonna just do that so we can fire out the right rocket. that dodge though, that was a good dodge. The camera like locks onto him every time he bloody goes upward. I don't like that. He's a massive all-black German Shepherd. It fits. Oh, that, that, that is pretty dope. I like that. Hey. Hey. Bro, he still got me anyway. No matter how many missiles I just threw at him, It's great to have your back, sir. No, it's E, but with a Lee on the name. I've never heard of a Ryan Lee in my life. It's me. That's what I'm going to be doing soon. That was aiming up, but I'll take it. He's a dodger? A schmoover? Can't 
see? Who needs to see, seeing as cringe? Run, run, run! I somehow, like, didn't burn my flippers. Take it. Right, we'll clear out this area, then we'll go do the dropping bomb stuff. Mm. I don't need to fly pretty high up in this room. Oh shit! That was close. Do a few bogeys. Pretty probably call them bogeys, right? Like, like a secret mission sort of thing. I feel like I got a lot of gems to pick up. Just get that feeling, you know? I think that's everything up on the ceiling. We shall now go over here. Okay. Peace. Oh, Ryan Lee, such a tragedy. Ah. Anyway, ladybugs to kill. I think it's actually like that. Okay. Oh, there's a gold gem there. I seen you. I seen you. We will have to go drop bombs soon. Drop massive penguin bombs. Okay, um... Oh. Another mole use. It's just a skill point to kill all the moles. Let's go. Okay, I think that's pretty much everything in here except the bound things. Okay, nice. Make sure nothing dropped down. Okay, I think we're good. Alright, and there's another container over yonder. Red game I missed. Oh, a, a How it feels to be such a bit. I'm just flying over this level. Nothing, I suppose, except the invisible walls. I almost went back through the portal. That would have been a tragedy. <laughs> Give me four more. No, no, I want four more. Thank you. Now we move, now we go back. Now we play the go back game. Let's go. We really killed all the moles in here. I think we got everything. Yes. There we go. I killed all the moles. Okay, now we 
just got a couple of gems to get. And one hummingbird to bring. Plants! My one weakness. I hope I didn't need more bombs. That would be unfortunate. I got all the games. Before I was captured, I recovered this egg from the enemy, sir. It's right! It's our boy! It's our boy! Let's go! I'm ready to be debriefed, sir. Can't believe we found our boy. Ah, oh, we're missing like two green gems. Gems, sorry. Keep doing it. I'm not sticking- I'm just gonna start calling them gems again. I can't- I can't- I can't stick to my own rule! What? It's been a rule. I'm just- I'm just an idiot. Alright. We're gonna check the starting area. First. These green gems, they're gonna like- They're gonna- they're gonna blend into the background. Everything's so green here. Alright. Would we live in Sergeant Bird's base? Yay or nay? Oh, whoops, I went the other way. There's one. It's not a bad area. Picture myself living here. And then they've got lights. Wall lights. So assuming they might have power outlets here. So yes, you probably could plug in your phone. That's not him. It's being the big out area. Which of course it is. Who like power outlets? They are good. So when we look at the image of the Mountain Dew today, um, like I recognise the Baja Blast. I know it's sort of like a thing over there. It's definitely not a thing over here. Um, but it reminds me of this like Death Note sketch where they're like ordering dinner. And like they come to this conclusion that like the Baja Blast is gonna is gonna like point out L uh, like is point, pointing out his death or something. It, it's really stupid. It reminds that remi that's what the Baja Blast reminds me of every time. Eternally in war. Ah, uh, I'm gonna say no. We'll say that these places are like Rhinox Freak, because Sergeant Bird's like already gone through, right? And Spyro's already gone through other worlds, like, let's just say there's like no more Rhinox. No more danger. Unless it's like danger that seems natural to the area. Like the octopuses and seashells, sure. Okay, where is this green gem? God, it's gonna blend into the grass, I just know it. Somewhere. Something? No, it's just a very small lit patch of grass for some reason. Now the Baja Blast is very popular here. It, especially big because it used to be exclusive to Taco Bell for a very long time. And somewhat recently it started being sold in stores. What, what's it taste like? What is the flavour? How would you describe the Baja Blast? Oh man, where is this bloody gem? There's so much grass around here, it could be anywhere. Oh, there it is. I see it. Alrighty, dokey. We're done. Uh, kind of fruitier. I'm not gonna lie, I actually prefer normal Mountain Dew, but I'd probably be crucified if I told someone else that. 
fruity Mountain Dew? Like, what kind of fruit? Like, a strawberry kind of fruity? Or, like, a... Like, a citrusy kind of fruit? Alright, now we're gonna go back to world one. So we can have an even gem count once again. Well, that was a very fast balloon. Like citrus, but sweeter than normal. Since standard Mountain Dew is citrusy. God, you guys have a lot of Mountain Dew flavors. We just literally have energized up here, and it's really crappy. You can get some specialty flavors in um, some of the stores that sell sell, uh, sell American flavors. That's Those are hard to come by. describes it as tropical lime. Mm, I don't know. It actually does not sound nice, but I don't know. I can generally handle most uh, soft drink flavors. No sugar ones, though. Oh, they kill me. They just replace it with worse sugar. That's That's all it is. But I sure didn't identify it as such. Right. Yeah, I get you. Well, it looks. I look good. Just go away, would you? I'm busy. I've got gems. I've got an even gem count to get. I missed my even gem count. I'm playing a game of hide and seek with my friends. If I can't find where they've hidden their heads, they won't let me join the Tiki Lodge. Help me put them back together and I'll make you an honorary member. Yeah. I'm gonna kill some people now. Fucking birds! I think the birds respawn. Flavors. There are so many soda flavors, but they are kind of just flavors. So true. Luna! It is a pretty good name. Because again, the only bird here allowed is me! Yeah, I guess we might as well get ahead while we're here. Mm. We'll look around for, for good old fashioned gems. I like Luna. That is a pretty good name. Ascend, ascend, brothers, ascend! Ow! We ascended, but it hurt! It hurt to ascend! Birds again! Oh my god, ow! Birds hurt! Okay, 
We're almost close to having an even gem count once again. Birds, get out here! Okay, is this it? Are these the final gems? Close, very close. We are one green gem away from being happy once again. Maybe two red gems. Apparently, if not, I don't know. Right. Oh! There. Alright, please let me be happy once again. That's a gem camp. Oh, the beauty. Ah, yeah. oh, there it is. There I am. There I am, guys. It's me. It's me. Well, that's never happened before. I hope it's not a bad omen. All right. Even numbers once again. Thank God. Oh, look at that beautiful 2200. Oh, it's beautiful. I think I will do one more level. One more. Level. It is getting a little bit late now. But I think we'll end it off on one more level. Your game camera. I know. Okay. Oh, I just charged. You know what? She deserved that. Third time she asked for that. Oh, I can do the sparks level. Oh. Spyro, I found You know what? Sure. Let's 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 do the sparks level. That way we're done with the spring world. Take on those nasty crawdads, I should give you some help. To start, let's practice shooting. Press the attack button to shoot these targets. God, Sparks looks very... He looks like, you know that movie, the the Pixar one with the, like, bugs? Is it Pixar or Disney? Pixar, Pixar. Um, yeah. Like, the, yeah, Bugs movie. He looks like that. Looks kind of gross. Um... Bugs Life, that's it, that's it. Um, okay, I looked it up. Baja Blast was exclusive to Taco Bell. Um, from 2004 to January. That's crazy, that's 20 years of exclusivity? Bruh. He looks like one of those grasshoppers. He does, he does, he does. Alright, I can strafe, can I? There we go, yeah. That, that's how you play this game, you strafe. You can also move quickly by pressing the charge button. Now for the hard part. Being a maneuverable dragonfly. Nice. I wouldn't mind these mini games. Not too bad. On your travels, you'll notice butterflies that give you health, just like in the dragon world. Not only that, but some butterflies will give you special powers, though only for a short time. Just eat any pa- Did I stuff up? Was I meant to press a button? Yeah, now I love Taco Bell, but a lot of people can't handle it, so they wouldn't just go there because they like one of the drinks. Power up butterfly, then press the jump button. 
Your power up is shown in the top right. Yeah. Gotcha. I'm sorry for handling it normally. Jeez. Is it because I just got touched that I have to restart it, bruh? I would like to try Taco Bell just once in my life. It is here in Australia, just not where I am. Go to Sydney. Looks like you're ready, Sparks. Oof indeed. Oof is the word I would use as well. Very sad. This one has like a bit of a key progress system. I can the door. No. I cannot. I suppose I can go through the red door though. Ow! I got hit. Ow! Oh my god. I I forgot what button to press. So then I then I just got. No, I mean, this box is never. Yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't very smart of me. I have infinite ammo again. Infinite, he says. Gotcha. Personally, I love it, but for a lot of people, it goes straight through them. That's the best part. Uh, do you guys have Cheez-Its? Uh, we do not have Cheez-Its. I, I had to pause to think about that for a moment. Like, what's well, what's cheesy? Through the green door. Oh, that was big crap. Some vulnerability. We have shapes. <laughs> True, we do have shapes. Like triangle and rectangle. Objectively better. Yesterday I went to a Taco Bell and they had a Crunchwrap Supreme. Think flat circular burrito and it had a massive cheese in inside. Cheese and some cheese flavored crackers. Is that like shapes? I like how Stuart shows up to talk about Cheez Its. Hi Stuart. <laughs> Welcome to the Cheez Its. Cheez It talk. Teaching me shapes. Oh look, someone had to teach you shapes. Let's go! Oh, rocket's power. On the crab face line Oh you can't believe you hit me. Boss arena. Oh, sure is. Oh, ow, hello. Okay, I'm gonna go. Rocket turn. Okay. Uh, I wasn't expecting that, I'll be honest. Right there. Mm -hmm. Bro? Yeah, geek. 
I sure didn't learn shapes in art school. Yeah, that'd be a fringe place to learn shapes. Oh, we did it! Yay! I don't think this is the gem finding ability. Maybe. I can't remember. Yeah, that was a bit of a short level. So I don't really want to do Enchanted Towers or Spooky Swamp. It was a bit of a long one. Those are very long ones. But the pan- oh, but the ice- uh, Could do a speedway. Nice work, Sparks. You've beaten the Crawdad King and found the lost egg. Not only that, but some of the dragon magic seems to have rubbed off on you. Now you can pick up oh, gems when they're even further away from Spyro. That's very helpful. Um, you know, we'll do that. We'll end up on the speedway, I reckon. I googled shapes. What the fuck is a crimpy? Um, what is crimpy? Are those like the drumstick ones? So I will end on a speedway. Something a bit fun, but I don't like. I don't like the midday garden levels. That much, except the panda one. The panda one's pretty fun. Chanted Towers isn't too bad, but that's a, that's a bit of a long level. It's a big level. We've got like the skateboarding and the the dog mission. That's gonna that's gonna take a while. It's a chicken crimpy. I know what a chicken is. I think. Explain to me. What do you think a chicken is? I would love to know. I would do Bamboo Terrace now, but I want to kind of save that for later because I'll be at an odd gem camp. We can't end on an odd gem camp because there's a Bentley section there. Ugh. Chicken is a man, according to that one philosopher. What is a man? A miserable pile of chicken. Speedway. Okay, as usual. Where's Hunter? Where where is that juicy boy? Um, he's like, oh, he's in like the big house in the middle, I think. How's that? Spyro! You're not gonna believe this, but there are sheep saucers and space cows all over this place. Did you say a bad you word? Yeah, I think that's the one against Asians. I'm gonna strap on my jetpack. What? Yeah. Like a. Yeah, I think it's a racist term. Look out, cows! Here like the just the end part, not not the not the actual chicken toys that you're making. Oh, I'm so bad. I'm so bad. I'm so bad. I don't know these words. Yeah. I don't want to say it on stream. I feel like I, I will get destroyed. Yeah, I won't. But yeah, it's just like the, the G O O. Well, I think it's just G O K, but um, yeah. That's the bad part. I can't hit shit, man. I can't hit shit.
anyway. I'm trying to jetpack him, alright? He's definitely jetpacking. It's definitely something he is currently doing at this time. Now I have to re on him how to PR chicken sandwich. That is correct. This egg. It's Roberto. Hello, Roberto. Fuck like a, a G A U K. One just strikes me as a jetpack guy. He does, doesn't he? Definitely a hunter thing to do. I know this route so well. Oh man. The memories, they come flooding in. Signs of the cow pop up. What? Don't kill don't kill me, I'm a cow. Oh shoot. I miss I missed the plane. Ah oh, shoot. I missed two planes. Oh that's so embarrassing. Right, we're gonna have to cut corners. A what? Well, I've screwed this one up. These planes are harder to hit than think. Anyway, I'm just gonna give up now. No, G A U K. Oh, sorry, not U K. G A W K. My mistake. Bro, are you killing cows? Ah, oh, you just ah. Oh, a red chat. Yeah, that's it. That's it. Alright, I'm not going to re-chat, I, I need to focus. Or I'll miss some cows. What? Cows? They're protesting like not to be killed. It's a pretty fair thing to be protesting there. Read the chat! <laughs> you won't catch me doing that. Not while I'm time attacking. Oh, it's Gavin. Hi, Gavin. Hi, Roy. Darn it. Do be racing once again. This one's a little more interesting because you get like missiles. towards the ground. Oh, that's that's probably lost me the race. No, oh, I think there's a thing in there. Oh, yep, there was a thing in there. You know what? Let's just... Let's just do that. Just have to remember the course again, you know? You know?
one plane? Ridiculously fast. I don't think it's worth going for that one because you just have to do so many tight turns. Oh, oh no, I got the missile? How did that happen? Okay, now this time. Uh, what? You did not miss that ring. <laughs> I just saw that fish and nails. <laughs> Bruh. You guys saw that. I didn't miss that ring. They tell lies. Oh. Okay, I almost missed that one. Almost, but not Okay, that that time I did miss it. I'll uh I'll oh god. I'm I'm back to video games. Why am I playing video games? I'm going to give up. I'm going to take up crochet. Oh my god. Why do I keep doing this to my face? Right, get slowed, nerd. Bruh. Oh my god. Be a little bit of pain doing this. Okay, I. What was that? Attempts getting used to the map. I might just, yeah. I bonk up my head. I missed the guy. Suck. Oh, idiot. Okay, what did I hit? Tell me what I hit. I'm generally curious. I would disagree with everything that just happened. Yeah, real quick, we're done through this ring around. Lap two, and I'm fourth place. It's not good. I say, no, <laughs> oh, God damn it. God damn you, Discord. Well, you stuff that up. Well, stuff that up. Rusty, gotta say. Still a little, uh, still a little bad at this. Like that? Holy crap, that was bad. What am I doing? Fly up, Spire. 
That was that was pretty bad. Holy crap. When you bonk, oh man, does it stuff you up. We can super cover from this, I think. Oh, I locked on target, bruh. Stop oofing me. I know I'm bad. You know what? I'm just gonna just gonna bite the bullet on that one. We finally managed to pull that off. That plane increases so much speed when, when he goes through that. Just go down. Now go up! Miss that missile? Oh. That's it. We can say that for the next guy, but I don't No, 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 no. I did not hit that. I'm sorry, but I did not hit that. You can stuff that up your pipe pop. I did not hit that at all. I'm feeling like it might be safer to go down, like, after that bridge area. Oh, I did it. Missed it. Oh, well. Don't matter. Monty Yellow Plane. Is that a Monty Yellow? He didn't, he like, he didn't slow down at all. Like right here, yeah, there we go. Oh, I missed it, no! Yellow Plane's giving me a run for my money. Where's first place? Oh! I'm far off that one! Oh my god! Where's Bruce Steering? I feel like there's a couple more shortcuts I can make use out of. Oh. Surprised I hit that ring. I would argue that I didn't hit that ring, but you know, it's fine. You blue plane. Alright, this isn't entirely fair. They don't get to shoot missiles at me. to sort of like do those two bits together. Okay, well that was a bit of a waste. Anyway. Like, no, that's, the, that's the shortcut I wanted to do. Oh, look at me, I'm gaming! Oh my god, this is yellow plane. This obnoxious yeah, oh, I missed the missile, that's really depressing. After the knee. Oh, 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 that was close. Hey! Oh, I missed it. Oh, that yellow plane's back. He's obnoxious! Tell him to go away! Okay, well I missed that one, that's fine. Okay, we're up with the lead plane. We just need to pass him. I'm gonna 
I'm on your ass, man. I'm on your ass, that's right. Yeah, buddy. Okay, woo. Woo. Okay, we're gaming. We just need to not prick up. Oh, that we got the dub. He's gaming? Inconceivable? It does happen sometimes. Let's go! <laughs> and we got Shimp. Uh, and it's a reference to the first fire again! Uh, I would like to quit, thank you, Scott. Can just remember now Sparks like he's got the like the sun sun thing on. He's got his sun, he's going, he's just going, yep. He's sunbaking, that's what he's doing. Let's stream with something light. Lucky like an hour ago. <laughs> true, true, true. In fact, let's just beat the whole game right now. We're not quitting. I'm joking. We've hit three and a half hours now. That's this is pretty good. It's 11, 11 p.m. I'm getting pretty tired now. Um Yeah. This was great. This was absolutely a great time. Um, I'm probably... I reckon this is either going to take three or four strings, depending on how much I... Ooh, uh, how much I do in a night. Um, like, I've made a lot of progress, but I've only done one world in one level, technically speaking, out of this one. We still like to do the four levels. Um, but we've done the speedway in this level, so I guess that's two of six. Um, if I beat world two and three next week, then... It might be done in three streams. No, I don't. I don't need to rush it, but yeah, it's uh, it's late now, so I'm gonna call it there. Anyway, thank you so much for joining me, getting up early and everything. That's it's crazy. Um, and thank you for everyone else to watching. It was it was a really good time. Um, starting off this list, it's it's starting off really really strong. So I'm looking forward to playing uh, games that go even higher. And now I can't picture anything but Swole Spyro standing before me on the left. You just you buff shoulders. <laughs> No rush, only dragon. Dragon, he's not so. Anyway, hi everyone. Have a look at it.